Hi everyone, my name is Mary. Welcome back to my channel, Mama Bear Prepper. My daughter and I, we went to Dollar Tree today. And as you can see in a video I posted before this sometime about Dollar Tree starting to sell things that's not a dollar, like $3 and $5 items. Y'all, uh, if you don't know what I'm talking about, I'm gonna post that video right up here in the description down below so you can check that out and read the article with me as I'm talking about it and explaining it so you know what I'm talking about if you have not heard of this already. But pretty much Dollar Tree is now selling items that's three and five dollars along with their dollar items, you know, that just have a, a few aisles that's more expensive and yeah, so I checked that out. I made a video, the video I posted before this, you know, I walk through the aisles and show you the aisles of what they look like and what kind of stuff they're selling for three and five dollars. I'm gonna go ahead and post that link right up here also. So you can come back at the end of the video, click on it, or I'll have it in the description down below. Um, Y'all, I love me some Dollar Tree and I went to the huge one today too. Because I have like a whole bunch of tiny smaller Dollar Trees near me, but I went ahead to like, <laughs> the Dollar Tree Mall, pretty much. It was like a huge, huge Dollar Tree. Filthy, but huge. They really need to clean that Dollar Tree. I mean, every time I go in there, it's just ugh, so disgusting. It's like it hasn't been clean in 10, 20 years. Like, honestly, <laughs> you will see what I'm talking about in that video I posted up here. I'm um, talking about the Dollar Tree Plus. It's now Dollar Tree Plus. They had a sign up front when we went in saying, you know, telling you it's Dollar Tree Plus and not all items are a dollar anymore. It can be three or five dollars. So anyways, I'm talking to my chair. I'm just going to go ahead and show you my haul. I got a few things, nothing, you know, nothing really too much here. Just slowly adding to my prepper pantry. You know, I got some turkey over here. I love the canned turkey. And Dollar Tree right now is the only place that has it. I found it at Walmart a while back, but I think it was only around the holiday time. So Dollar Tree has the canned turkey year round. So I always stock up on that. I got, let's see, two, four, six, eight, ten. I got 10 cans of that. That was a dollar. Yeah, I didn't buy any of the items that was more than a dollar at Dollar Tree. I don't think I'm ready for that yet, you guys. And if I am going to spend like $5 on a container or something, I'm going to maybe go to Walmart or somewhere else and look around, see what they got first, you know? Okay, so canned turkey for my prepper pantry. These two items are new. I have never seen these before. I guess they had these out for the holiday, but y'all, if you love oatmeal, I'm not a big oatmeal eater. I'll eat it like once in a blue moon, but pumpkin spice mm, and gingerbread. Y'all, so I picked these up. They're, you know, of course, a dollar each. I can't wait to try this, you know, made in Canada. And this is the nutrition facts, if you're interested. You know a limited edition so if y'all are interested in this go find it now in your local Dollar Tree if y'all have it um, there was other flavors too I posted you know I showed you in the video before this you know the me walking through the Dollar Tree aisles you know it's a huge Dollar Tree I don't go through every single aisle because <laughs> you'll see how big it is in some of the shots I got but there was uh, like a hot chocolate oatmeal one an apple one and like another one, I can't remember, but these two really sparked my interest with the pumpkin spice and gingerbread. All right, I got another thing of shaving cream. Um, Y'all, I really like the scent at Walmart, the coconut one at Walmart, I forgot what brand it is. It's a little bit more expensive, but my daughter keeps wasting it. Every time she goes in the shower, she plays with all my products and she wastes everything. I'm so sick and tired of it. Like she'll waste my whole thing of shower cream. Uh, just playing. I fuss at her about it, but it just she don't listen. So I picked me up one for a dollar. I'm gonna have to hide it from her. While I was there, I found these. These are the Assured brand from Dollar Tree. These are how many razors? Two, four? Is it? Yeah, four blades. And this is a pack of four. Is it pack of four? no pack of three? Yeah, pack of three, and it has four blades. Uh, so I bought two of those for a dollar each, you know, stocking up on stuff like this before. <laughs> you know, if you hear the articles about the rolling blackouts in China, and y'all, you know, all of this, most of the stuff comes from China, you know. So with them limiting their, their power and electricity in their manufacturing places, it's really going to impact us even more than what is being done right now, okay? So, I got three boxes of tissues. I'm trying to stack up on these. 
these y'all 148 tissues for one dollar i really hope they don't go up on, on those prices for the dollar for the tissues <clears throat> i like to get my napkins from there 150 napkins for a dollar i got two of those i got one of these this is the um lime away toilet bowl cleaner i'm gonna try that i've never tried that brand but i'm going to try it all right, and I also got a meat chopper. This is just something I don't have, so I picked up one of those. Um, some nasal strips, you know, for when it's cold and flu season, and if I get a stuffy nose. I don't know if these are going to work as good as the name brand ones that I usually get, but this really helps open up your nasal passages and helps you to breathe at night so you can get a good night's sleep when you're sick. But, y'all, I just hope these work as good as the name brand ones, okay? A pack of tissues. I bought these, you know, for... Um, my daughter's school bag and for our purses pretty much so we got those hand warmers and they also had toe warmers and I should have grabbed I don't know why I didn't grab a toe warmer I never tried the toe warmers before but these these are really good during winter time I got two of the clear plastic storage box containers I am I am currently working on organizing and just going through my tiny little pantry in my kitchen it's really not even a pantry it's like shelves i don't have an actual pantry like with a closet door or anything so i'm going through that i'm trying to organize it more and just make it more organized and accessible so when we're trying to look for something we can easily find it so i had to pick up two more of those because i like to store some stuff in there maybe i'll put in one like some um seasoning packets like the mccormick packets i like in gravy mixes in one i'm not really sure i'll figure something out so and everything that's extra that's just in my way, I'm going to put in my prepper stockpile um, either here or at another location. Because, um, oh, as you can see in my shopping halls, I buy a lot. <laughs> so I just, I'm going through everything and just trying to make things make more sense for me and moving things around and just going through it all, you know. All right. A night light. We need another night light. And I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to try this one, see how it turns out for us dish drying mats y'all i love me some dish drying mats um i like all sorts of patterns and designs so i found these at the dollar tree one dollar each i like the little pumpkins and this one's like the fall type of thing right here and this little tray um i had bought a couple of these during christmas time several years back they were more round not oval and then you know at walmart they got those big crawfish seafood trays for like when you're boiling crawfish and stuff. Y'all, those are great. I actually need to get some more of those because those actually have the, um, like it's round like this, but it, the end, what do you call it? The edge, it goes up so no drink or food can spill out of it. And during movies, when me and my daughter watch a movie or whatever, if we want to take our food outside and eat, <clears throat> these are great to carry everything on. We put our little plate or bowl on here. Or if you have something hot, um, I just put the hot bowl on here and I bring it, you know, to the table or on the couch, wherever we're eating at. And these just work out so great, you know, put your bowl of spaghetti, put your breadstick right here in your drink, you know, whatever you need, it all fits on here. So you, when you are eating outside or barbecuing or whatever, you can carry everything on this tray. Y'all, it's such a huge, huge help. So I like to get different designs and patterns, and I found this one. This was the only design I had at the Dollar Tree I went to today. So I picked it up because the only ones we've been using throughout the whole year are Christmas-themed ones and just a plain blue crawfish seafood boil type of tray. All right, I think that's everything I just went through. Uh, one other thing, we went to Five Below. I just have to show you guys this. I bought this for my dog. Um doggy pajamas you know you gotta think of your pets too during the winter and cold months no they get cold too <laughs> they get really cold so I picked this up for a little Roxanita um I just love the little the little booty part of this with the buttons it's so cute it was five dollars at five below a lot better of a price than if you would go dog clothes shopping at PetSmart or somewhere like that you know so whenever I find something at five below that my dog can fit into that she could use, I get it for her. And these, this does keep her really warm. I mean, yeah, I mean, it helps out a lot. It really does. 
especially when she has to go out and party and play. It's time to play outside. She can put this on and sometimes a sweater over this because she's, you know, she's a little dog. She's like only 10 pounds. So she don't have that much meat on her to keep her warm. And this really does help. So think of items like this for your pets too, because y'all, I think this winter is going to be a lot more cold <clears throat> than last winter. And, you know, you just need to keep your fur babies warm. So if you have a five below, I would highly recommend to go check there for, for dog clothes. Anyways, it's a really good deal to have dog items there, like dog leashes, clothes, pajamas, jackets, uh, dog bowls, dog toys, all for $5 or under. So it beats the more expensive stores like PetSmart when it comes to items like that. So I like to keep an eye out there every time I go for a little Roxanne. All right, y'all, that does it from a haul. I am so thirsty. I gotta go get something to drink. <clears throat> um, all right, I'm gonna go ahead and put this up and get back to my kitchen. I'm trying to work on my kitchen. I have a big mess in there. It's a mess. All right, you guys, I hope you like this. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. Take care.